This is the perfect setup for gaming. And here's how I built it. I started off with a plain desk, and then I gathered all the things I need for the setup. For example, the keyboard, the mouse, and a bunch of different accessories. After doing that, it was time to build the setup. Of course, first we have the laptop. It has pretty decent specs, and it should be perfect for the setup. Watch till the end because I'll be testing which setup performs better. This laptop setup or my main PC setup. In the setup, we're not going to be using any monitors because this laptop has already a pretty good display. Alright, so right here we have this empty desk, and in the middle we're going to place the laptop. Now that we did that, let's set up the laptop cooler. So normally gaming laptops produce a lot of heat. So this laptop cooler will help cool down the laptop so we can have the best performance when gaming. This laptop cooler is from Thermaltake and to use the cooler you just plug it in via USB. On the back you can control the speed of the fan and also turn on the LED light and it also has height adjustable legs which allow more air to be under the laptop. Now let's go over what keyboard, mouse, mouse pad, and microphone we're going to be rocking in this setup. Oh and also the desk we're using is a white glass desk and it should match the setup. For the mouse pad we have two options. First option is this Gutsy Aiden mouse pad and the second option is this mouse pad from Create Work Play. Let's take a look and see how they look in the setup. The design on the Gutsy Aiden mouse pad looks really good but I think it covers up the desk too much for this setup. Alright and here's how the second mouse pad looks like in this setup. I think we're going to be going with the second option because it doesn't take up that much of the desk. For the mouse we're going to be using the Diarrhea Falcon. The reason we're going to be using this mouse is because we're going to be using a keyboard from Diarrhea. I picked this keyboard and mouse because they match really well. Alright and just like that the setup is almost complete. Not really, but almost. I'm also going to be adding a microphone to this setup. Moano sent me out this microphone, and it's a pretty solid microphone for the price. This is the perfect microphone for this setup because it comes with a stand, and it also sounds really good. And of course, you can't have a setup without RGB or decorations, so we're going to be adding some things to the setup. First thing we're going to be adding is the skylight, which can turn any wall into this. Yeah, this guy is going to make the setup look so much better. And just like that, the setup is looking a lot better. Alright, so I added this floodlight under the desk, and it's giving out the this little glow that looks really good. I'm actually really happy with the look of the setup right now. After that, I did some cool things to the setup and added some more decorations, and then the setup is now finally done. Personally, I love how the setup turned out, but let me know what you guys rated 1 through 10 in the comments down below. All right, now I'm gonna give you guys a quick setup tour and montage, and then we're gonna test out the setup. Alright, I hope you guys like this montage. Now let me give you guys a quick setup tour. On the left you have this little candle. To the right you have the microphone. It's the Mono HD300T. It actually sounds really good for the price and I would recommend checking it out. For the mouse pad, we're rocking this mouse pad from Create Work Play. And in my opinion, I think it looks really good. And then on top of the mouse pad, we have the peripherals. For the keyboard, we're rocking this keyboard from Diarrhea. And then the mouse is called the Diarrhea Falcon. I really like this peripheral setup because it's from the same company and they look really good together. Also the RGB lighting on the keyboard matches the setup and then the blue on the mouse kind of matches the back like also here matches my wallpaper and also the mouse pad. Alright for the laptop we're rocking a gaming laptop with the RTX 2060 and the i7 10th gen. It has a 144 hertz display so yeah we don't really need a monitor for this setup because it has a really good display. And then under the laptop we have laptop cooler because laptops tend to get really hot so the laptop under the laptop cooler will cool down the laptop and let us have really good performance while we're playing games. And then to the right of the setup we have this little plant and then we have a lamp. I really like how the setup turned out. Now let's see how it performs in game compared to my PC. Alright, so my gaming PC will probably outperform the gaming laptop because it has better specs. Alright, so to make this a little bit funner, we're going to be playing a game of deathmatch on my laptop and then we're going to be playing a game of deathmatch on my PC. So yeah, in the setup that I get the most kills is just going to be, I guess, the winner. Alright, so yeah, let's get into the deathmatch. Alright, so on my main setup, I got 35 kills. Now on to the laptop setup. Alright, so for some reason, Valorant on my laptop does not want to update. Uh, it's at 45% and it's been there for like an hour. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you want to see me build the best laptop streaming setup. <laughs>